OK, part question 1C. The graph shows the change in levels of equal masses of CO2 and this stuff here. And so we want to name that. OK, so let's always draw it out when you're trying to name a compound. So there's CH2, so there's a H off here and a H off here. And then there's an F and there's a C and an F3. So the F must be coming off here and the F must be off here. Uh, that's the only way I can see that you can draw it so that there's four bonds. Okay, so uh, this is gonna we're gonna go for this here. This is the one, two, uh, one. This will be the first carbon because it's got the most significant numbers of uh, functional groups, and there's uh, four fluorines in there. And so we have to we have to say where all the fluorines are. And so there's a one. You always do a, a comma between the ones. And so there's one, 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 two. And this that makes up the four. And there's four fluorine, so it's tetra. Uh, and then you took the halogen out. Okay, so it's fluoro. Uh, and there's a it's a two carbon, so it's ethane. So it's fluoroethane. So the answer is one, 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 two tetrafluoroethane.